St. Basil's Church on the campus of the University of St. Michael's College in downtown Toronto, the National Catholic Broadcasting Council presents Daily Mass. The televising of today's Mass is made possible by a contribution from Jerry LaRose from Lac La Nonne and Leo LaRose from St. Albert, Alberta. This Mass is offered for the deceased members of their family and for those family members who suffer at the lack of reconciliation in their family. Our thanks go out to Jerry LaRose and Leo LaRose for choosing to remember the members of their family with the gift of this Mass. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. The grace of God, the love of Christ, the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. As we begin our celebration, let us recall that we are in the presence of the risen Christ and that we do need his continuing mercy and forgiveness. You were sent to heal the contrite, Lord, have mercy. You came to call sinners, Christ, have mercy. You plead for us at the right hand of the Father, Lord, have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Let us pray. Almighty God, our hope and strength, without you we falter. Help us to follow Christ and to live according to your will. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the book of Ecclesiastes. Vanity of vanities, says the teacher. Vanity of vanities, all is vanity. What do people gain from all the toil at which they toil under the sun? A generation goes and a generation comes, but the earth remains forever. The sun rises and the sun goes down and hurries to the place where it rises. The wind blows to the south and goes around to the north. Round and round goes the wind, and on its circuits the wind returns. All streams run to the sea, but the sea is not full. To the place where the stream flows, there they continue to flow. All things are wearisome, more than one can express. The eye is not satisfied with seeing, or the ear filled with hearing. What has been is what will be, and what has been done is what will be done. There is nothing new under the sun. Is there a thing of which it is said? See, this is new. It has already been in the ages before us. The people of long ago are not remembered, nor will there be any remembrance of the people yet to come by those who come after them. The word of the Lord.
teach us to count our days that we may gain a wise heart. Turn, O oh Lord, how long? Have compassion on your servants. In every age, O oh Lord, you have been our refuge. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. truth and the life says the Lord no one comes to the Father except through me the Lord be with you a reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Jesus called the twelve together and gave them power and authority over all demons and to cure diseases. And he sent them out to proclaim the kingdom of God and to heal. He said to them, take nothing for your journey, no staff, nor bag, nor bag, nor bread, nor money, not even a net. Herod the ruler heard about what Jesus had done, and he was perplexed, because it was said by some that John had been raised from the dead, by some that Elijah had appeared, and by others that one of the ancient prophets had arisen. Herod said, John, I beheaded, but who is this about whom I hear such things? And Herod tried to see Jesus. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise you. 